Okay, here we are to lay out the pattern. This is a per the uh, pattern instructions. Okay, so I've cut out the right hand side along the border edge here. Okay, we'll do the same for all the horizontal pieces, cutting the top part off, tape it all together so we're ready to cut it out after that. Okay, it's all cut out now. We'll get rid of all the excess paper and then we'll lay things out according to the design. All right, here are all the cutout pieces laid out on the fabric. You could use any fabric. This is a uh, kind of a ballistic nylon I guess uh, I got it um, I got it kind of a seconds place for like four bucks a yard anyway it's nylon so you can uh, run the edges uh, near a candle flame and seal them anyway it's all pinned out ready to cut out these smaller pieces right here I did not pin it's a waste of time it's going to use a sharpie you could use a a washable pencil here like one of these or whatever if you wanted to but Sharpie works best it's a uh, part of the leftover fabric anyway and you just kind of draw it out cut them all out and then you have all the pieces ready to go okay one more thing about cutting I highly recommend you get a mat one of these get one of these these are suction cups they put on there so you can hold it but and then one of these uh, cutting wheels. These are awesome. This is an Ulfa. I was told this is the best one by my wife. Apparently it is because it works awesome. Put the fabric on top of this and then you just trace it out. Use the straight edge. It works awesome. Way faster than a regular scissors. Okay, all the pieces are cut out. They're numbered at the top edge it'll go underneath the fold and we're ready to sew it up 